Once upon a time, there was a show that everybody hated and then somehow came back. A show I never thought I'd talk about again. A show I completely forgot. Do you remember The Idol? Let's talk about it. Yeah, that's right. Somehow, the show you thought you could escape has returned. And it's winning big. It's doing big things, even though it's hard to be canceled. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're like, The Idol. What was that show again? You remember the show with The Weeknd and Lily Rose Depp and every inch of Lily Rose Depp's body <laughs> in inappropriate ways? A very vile, weird, uh, guilty pleasure show. <clears throat> I can remind you of it if you if you really like. We can take a look. Do you, do you remember this? We'll, we'll watch just like an inch of it. Remember how sweaty every single human being was? Remember how she wore literally no clothes? And they would have weird music sequences where he'd be doing stuff to her while she was singing. It was very creepy. I don't like any of it. Yeah. Remember how you've never seen a music video this dirty before? Remember how somehow they put Eli Roth in this because, you know, he's barely skeezy at all. Remember how that girl Jenny from uh, Blackpink was supposed to be famous because of this? I guess she's done some stuff, but we're waiting a little too long here. It's how weird. It's so weird. I don't like this at all. <clears throat> let's see. Hold on. You want to see her hoo-ha? They, they're like, yeah, let's, let's just show off her hoo-ha. Look at everybody smiling down at her. This whole thing was... <laughs> look, she's there bending her over. You know? Ooh. It's... <laughs> look, she's riding a guy on the ground. No big deal. Just a pile, writhing pile of bodies. <laughs> look, there's her... Her, her hoo-ha again. <laughs> there's one shot. Where, let's see if it's here. Yay! What a great music rehearsal this was. <laughs> and now she's riding the guy. Uh, oh, look at that. They're all riding each other in a row. Look how look how great that is. I could, I could go on forever. Um, but yeah, this whole thing was highly disturbing, to say the least. So, I will say I'm not a big fan. That's for sure. But guess who is a big fan? The Emmy Committee. The Idol wins Emmy despite backlash and cancellation. Isn't that just encouraging bad behavior? Isn't that what we're doing here? I don't understand. So anyway... Looks like it now has officially more enemies. Enemies. <laughs> it does have enemies. It has more Emmys than critically acclaimed shows like The Wire and Better Call Saul. You know, and it went up against... Okay, it won an award for outstanding choreography for scripted programming with choreographer Nina McNeely's work, beating out Only Murders in the Building, Palm Royal, and Physical. It was canceled after one season, remind you. But uh, The Wire was nominated for two Emmys, you know, one of those top five shows of all time. And Better Call Saul got 53 Emmy nominations, but no wins. Yet The Idol has beat it out. Makes a lot of sense there, folks. A lot of sense. Do you remember the controversy around this show? Remember how Rolling Stone did an expose saying, like, there was abuse on the weekend? For, you know, not just you know, from Abel Taste the weekend, the, and the only person you know, Lily Rose Depp knew how to shut her mouth. She's like, "No, nah, everything's great, not a big deal. Loved every second of it. I enjoyed the whole thing. You know, the parts where he spin on me, great." <laughs> it was a fun mess to hate watch. It sure was. I agree with that. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone hated the show. 
And it was not empowering to anybody. Like, there was just nothing about it. Everybody came out of this looking slimy. <laughs> I don't know if The weekend will ever get a show ever again. But Lily Rose Depp, she, she came out of this all right. I haven't seen her act in anything else. How long ago did this get canceled? Like a year ago? Two years ago? Five years ago? I don't know. But it won an Emmy. <laughs> it's so funny. This show was so crazy. So crazy. I just... I don't know. I, I don't know how they pulled... Uh, I know I got canceled because it was gross. But they just kept it going. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, what do you guys think? Do you think they should have won an Emmy? Does that make a lot of sense to you? I don't think it should have won anything. I didn't even remember it existed. I totally put the show out of my mind. It was like the unhealthiest flavor of pop, not popcorn, candy you could ever have. You're just like, oh, I'm going to eat. It's like trying to eat an entire large Snickers bar, and you're just like, can I really eat a large Snickers bar? I probably shouldn't, you know, because you can eat the little snack size ones, but this is a whole Snickers bar. Not that. In and afterwards, you're like, God, I, I wish I hadn't eaten that. It was disgusting. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Did you watch it, first of all? Did you hate watch it? Did you remember it existed? Would you watch it again? There's no way I watch it again. Not, not going to happen. You couldn't pay me to watch it again. It was a cult. And it, no, not going to happen. Not interested. So anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Do appreciate you. But I am on to the next one. Thanks for catching the video. Be sure to join our channel to get the education you deserve. Make sure you check out our shorts, live streams, and catch us on all the socials. Don't forget to like and subscribe.